Ever heard the one about the Afghan hound who wouldn't leave the house without applying mascara first? It's a riot, isn't it? This tall tale is a nod to the Afghan hound's majestic long silky hair, often leading people to believe they're the divas of the dog world. It's easy to imagine them primping and preening in front of a mirror but let's set the record straight. This luxurious coat isn't about vanity, oh no, it's about survival. Originating in the harsh climates of Afghanistan, the Afghan hound's thick mane is a natural adaptation designed to protect against extreme weather conditions. It's not a fashion statement, but a clever evolutionary trick. So, while it may look like they've just stepped out of a doggy salon, their flowing locks are more about function than form. So no, your Afghan hound isn't reaching for your mascara, they're just rocking their natural weather-resistant coat. Some say Afghan hounds are the supermodels of the dog world. All beauty, no brains. Is that really true? Now let's dive into this myth. Many people believe that these stunning creatures are all about looks and don't have much going on upstairs. This assumption, however, is far from the truth. The Afghan hound, with its regal bearing and elegant stride, does indeed give off an air of aloofness. But don't mistake their independent nature for a lack of intelligence. These dogs are quite capable of complex problem solving. They're not just about chasing their tails or fetching balls, oh no, they're more likely to be found figuring out how to open a gate or get to that tantalizing treat on the top shelf. Their intelligence, however, is of a different kind. They're not the type to blindly follow orders or crave constant approval. They're independent thinkers making their own decisions. Just because they're not always eager to please doesn't mean they're not smart, they're simply independent thinkers. Ever felt like an Afghan hound is giving you the cold shoulder? You're not alone. There's a prevalent myth that these majestic creatures are unfriendly or aloof. But let's debunk that misconception right away, shall we? While it's true that Afghan hounds might seem a bit distant to strangers, that's far from the whole story. You see, these dogs are actually quite selective about who they let into their inner circle. It's not that they're unfriendly, they're just careful. Once an Afghan hound decides you're part of the pack, they reveal their true colors, they form deep, enduring bonds with their loved ones, and are known to be incredibly affectionate. Yes, you heard it right, they're big softies at heart. So it's not about being icy or aloof, it's about picking their friends wisely. So next time an Afghan hound seems to ignore you, don't take it personally, they're just playing hard to get. So, what have we learned about our Afghan hound friends today? Well, we've discovered that they're not the prima donnas of the dog world, despite their glamorous locks. They don't spend hours primping in front of mirrors or demand the finest doggy couture. They're just naturally blessed with a fabulous coat that's part of their breed's unique charm. We've also debunked the myth that Afghan hounds are all beauty and no brains. They're actually quite intelligent, albeit in their own unique way. They're independent thinkers, which can sometimes be mistaken for stubbornness or aloofness. And speaking of aloofness, Afghan hounds are not the cold and distant creatures they're often portrayed to be. They can be quite affectionate and loyal to their human families although they may be a bit reserved around strangers. The key takeaway? It's crucial to understand an animal's true nature and behavior before jumping to conclusions based on stereotypes or misconceptions. Remember, every Afghan hound is an individual and they're much more than just a beautiful face. So the next time you see one, don't forget to look beyond the hair.